Thank you for returning to the Westchester Real Estate Values channel. I'm John and today's vlog will focus on how your home can help you beat work from home burnout. Work from home burnout refers to being in your home constantly and having a lack of location change affect your work-life balance and mental health negatively. Some have reported feeling tired or just losing their focus throughout the day the longer they work from home. In fact, remote workers may have to work a little more to make their space meet their needs. Don't worry, there are ways to enjoy your space while combating the negative effects of prolonged work from home burnout. Here are a few ways to reclaim your home and how it can help you kick the work from home burnout blues. Enhance your living space. Swapping out decor now and then is par for home ownership. However, upgrading your decor to something that helps refocus your mind and allows you a bit of breathing room is recommended for those working and living from home. Try getting a breath of fresh air while incorporating living decor into your home. House plants can help elevate your mood while giving you something out of the ordinary to focus on. They've also been known to clean the air around you and help keep certain odors and contaminants out while making the room feel fresh. If you'd rather look into more functional ways to enhance your living space, try using organization and storage areas. Creating space on a counter or a table is a great way to give the allure of being clean while giving your items a new and convenient home. Enjoy your living space. Every home has a space inside it that makes for a good getaway place. If you need to find a corner to spend your lunch break, reading a book, and enjoying a cup of coffee, try setting up a small table and chair near a window. This will also help you provide more natural light, which has been known to bring elevated effects to most rooms. If you find you have more space with fewer things in it, try creating a meditation corner or a space for light exercise, like even yoga. Keeping your blood flowing and taking breaks to clear your head it are great methods to maintain productive work weeks. One of the perks to working remotely is your space is yours, so you can use it as you need to. For those with completely blank walls that seem to be taking its toll on you, try something soothing in nature, such as a water element surrounded by natural or living pieces like a living wall covered in climbing house plants. These elements can help stimulate an outdoor break area or even a peaceful garden. Embrace your living space. Every so often it's best to embrace your, your situation, but that doesn't mean you can't create a remote environment that best suits your needs. If your space is small, but distractions are large, try adding a few room dividers or room dividing places, such as bookshelves. Breaking up the room is an excellent way to avoid remote work burnout as it creates a dedicated workspace that separates home, life, and other elements. If you still find yourself feeling a little out of sorts, Try rearranging your home's furniture. It's not as large of a project as a full reg renovation, can, but it can help ease your work from home burnout by giving you a fresh perspective in the same space by showing things differently. When working from home, burnout is bound to happen. There are ample ways to maintain your well being when working from home, such as maintaining scheduled work hours deep breathing, exercises during your day, and getting enough sleep. Maintaining social connections with co-workers and other friends, family, and community members can also have a great impact on your mental health and help you avoid work 
from home burnout. Thank you for viewing, visiting. Please like, share, and subscri subscribe. And if you have any questions, inquiries, or any comments whatsoever, leave them down below in the comments box. And I promise I read them, I respond to them, and I'll get back to you with them. Thank you very much. I look forward to seeing you soon. Bye-bye.